Hi, I'm Alex with SciTech Discovery Center. Today I'm going to talk about fossils and what, how we get fossil fuels from them. So to start out with though, to make your little fossil, you want a little container of Play-Doh and a Swedish fish. I've already taken one out of the bag for this. So go ahead and open up your Play-Doh, flatten it out into a nice little pancake, and then press the Swedish fish right on to the Play-Doh. Don't push too hard because you're going to pull it back out in just a minute. Fold the Play-Doh over, then unfold it, pull the Swedish fish out, and you have a nice little fossil right there. Now for the second half, let's get another container of Play-Doh. I'm using the same color again because I'm going to show a difference in a minute between the two different, play uh, two different fossils that we have, but you can use whatever colors you want. I chose SciTech Purple. You want to tear off a little piece of your foil, stick it right in the middle, just kind of press it in, fold over the Play-Doh, unfold it, and it doesn't look like anything, it kind of just looks a little messy. If you look at them t uh, together though, the, uh, there's another difference between the foil fossil and the Swedish fish fossil. The foil one is kind of dull and not shiny, where the Swedish fish fossil has quite a bit of shininess to it, and that's because there's oil inside of the Swedish fish, just like there would have been oil inside of a prehistoric fish or dinosaur. And when they died and became a fossil, the oils from their body were trapped in the rock, and what we do when we make gasoline and other fossil fuels is we mine that rock and pull the oil out and burn it for fuel. So thank you for watching, and please check back for more videos later.